And we're in Temecula Valley for today's SoCal Spotlight, and KCAL News reporter Sheba Turk is live at the Swing In Cafe with its famous owner, Breaking Bad actor Dean Norris. Good morning, right, Sheba. Guys, I see we you are already got you a seat at the table of Temecula and this morning SoCal Spotlight. And one of the spots is Swing In Cafe. This building has been around since the 1920s and it's got a new owner now. Dean Norris from Breaking Bad, good morning. How you doing? Good morning to you. Welcome to Temecula. It's been wonderful so far. We've had hot air balloons, we've had wineries, and now we bought barbecue. Now you got barbecue for breakfast. Here at the Swing In, we just started this a couple months ago and it's just been a big hit. Of course, we've been a diner since 1927. We're the only, we're, we're only the fourth family to own this place wow. so we take it very seriously uh, to kind of keep it the icon that it is. This is awesome. How did you even come about you and your wife owning it? I know you got it last year. Well we've been out here for 22 years we uh, raised our kids here and when it came up for sale, I kind of wanted to keep it in the, uh, kind of keep it uh, local. I didn't want it to be torn down or, or turned into some development. So we decided to buy it and uh, beef it up a little bit. Awesome. And look, let's show people in here this morning. It's packed. We pulled them outside and we were like, are they having an event because they're on TV today? And we're like, nope, folks are just here to eat. Yeah, well, you know, it's well known for one of the best breakfasts around. People dig it. Like I said, it's been here for continuously operating for more than 100 years. Wow. So that's, uh, that'll say something. So much history. Our SoCal Spotlight is all about showing what makes a community special. What do you love about Temecula? Uh, you know, I love the family values about it. I love the fact that we raised our family here. I have five kids, and uh, they loved it. It's a small town feel, but we're only an hour or so from L.A., so we get best of both worlds. Yeah, this is really cool. All right, and then tell us about the acting world. What's going on? Well, I got three uh, three movies I finished. One's called Six Triple Eight with Tyler Perry. One's called Carry On uh, with Taron Edgerton, and uh, the other one's called The Parenting, which is a horror comedy movie with uh, Brian Cox and Edie Falco and uh, Lisa Kudrow and I are uh, uh, husband and wife. Um, yeah, all coming out this year. How do you balance doing all of that and being here? Well, luckily I have a great management staff, so when I'm gone for, you know, a month, month and a half, uh, the place runs and it takes care. Of, they're, they're, they're good enough people to make sure it runs without me being here. Tell me some of the other favorite menu items besides the barbecue. Oh, well, we have a great country fried steak. It's been on the menu forever. Country fried steak. And we just got, we got fresh Belgian waffles that everyone loves, so, uh, and many more. Sounds amazing. <laughs> what kind of stuff do you love to do in Temecula? I was so excited to do the hot air balloon ride this morning. Didn't get a chance to do it because of the fog. Yeah. What else fun stuff is there to do? Well, there's some great golfing out here. And I'm had, being an actor, I happen to be a golf addict. So I do a lot of golfing uh, and a lot of hiking because there's some great places to hike out here. So, yeah. you know, get the outside stuff going in. All right. And then next door, I understand you have plans for another spot. Tell me about that. I do. We have a building next door that we're going to turn into a bar restaurant. It's right here in Old Town, Temecula. And uh, we're working with the city right now and the plans to get that taken care of and uh, hopefully in the books this year. I understand that spot is going to be a nod to Temecula's cowboy history. It is. It's going to be a nod to Boot Hill. We have a little place called Boot Hill, which has a little cemetery out here. And um, we're going we're gonna to call it the Boot Hill Saloon. Very, nice. Very cowboyish. We'll definitely have to come back and try that out. All right, we're well, looking out of the window right now. I understand there's a big surprise for Breaking Bad fans. Tell us about it. Well, there's been a there's been a graveyard out there that my kids, ever since they were little, would always go out and love. It's got some funny stuff. And since I bought the place, I put a little tombstone out there for Hank Schrader, a little oh. Rip Hank Schrader tombstone. So if you come by, you know, it's a little Easter egg. Check it out. Very Cool. Breaking Bad fans are going to love this, and everybody's going to love the barbecue, guys. Dean, thanks for breakfast. Thank you. Amy, I'm going to send it back over to you.